Okay, I think I just got a really good idea of how to explain this. If you let this area just heal on its own, it probably won't heal completely because the edge of that, the inside edge of whatever this hole is underneath there is sort of healed over. It doesn't stick together, kind of like a piece of bread. Like if you fold it, it's not gonna stick together, right? This means that, like say this is the top of the skin and I squeeze all the stuff out, but there's this hole in there, it will probably tend to fill up again, especially depending on the size of, a, of the hole. If it's really big, it's gonna be more likely to fill up again with dirt and sebum and things like that, but it will give you joy again, right? To squeeze that again. To really get rid of this definitively is to cut it out, meaning on the surface of your skin, you cut this entire area out, put it back together again, but you're gonna have a longer scar, probably longer than the actual area that it started with. Another option is if you sort of roughed up the inside part of that opening, this sack or the space that the cyst or the blackhead occupied. Kind of like what you could do with like jelly. So I was trying to find strawberry jelly, which looks more red like blood, but all I have is grape jelly. If I squeeze some jelly on this, not that I'm putting blood or anything in there, but I'm like refreshing the wound edges. I'm taking like a curette or I'm cutting the edge out, I'm roughing it up. If I sort of take like a, a knife or a curette or something and kind of refresh the wound edges so it's more, it's like um, raw, it will stick together like this. See? So then it'll stick together and it will seal. And then you don't really eat it.